on East 10th Street. I ride this one or number eight. Susan Gooley and her daughter, Shanna Bennington, use the bus almost daily. I depend on the boat to go to the doctor's appointments, my work, grocery shopping. But lately, a lot of that time has been spent waiting. And I've waited up to three hours for a bus because the bus never showed up. Wait times, Indigo says, is largely due to a driver shortage. We need to hire a minimum of about 100 drivers to get the service to where we want it to be and where we need it to be. So in the meantime, the Transit Corporation is changing 12 routes starting June 11th. So that That's dotted line thing. is what's going away. To start, four of those routes will experience frequency changes. So that means instead of a bus coming every 30 minutes, it may come every 45 minutes. The other routes will be realigned and modified. That means we're going to be changing the routes a little bit where maybe one piece of a route will go away, but then maybe another route may pick that up. And the southeast side will take the brunt of these changes after a drop in the number of riders. Why are we um, devoting drivers? Why are we sending buses to areas where there are no riders? So it's really um, streamlining realigning and just making sure we're being as efficient, efficient as possible with the resources we have. Changes riders like Susan and Shanna hope will only make their trips quicker and on time. And of course, there are a lot of changes. So to help, Indigo is holding three meetings to answer some of those questions. The first one will happen on May 16th. And you can also find more information and a map to all these changes on our website at WTHR.com. In Indianapolis, Lauren Kostick, 13 News.